everyone, it's Kay. It is the morning of October 5th, and I had a much better night's sleep last night, so I hope that is going to set the tone for the day. Obviously, you can see I'm in my classroom. I hope this afternoon to have a little bit of time to work on my Day 5 Preptober stuff. It is to write a scene where my character is talking to a therapist, which should be fun. <laughs> because I feel like they both have some complex issues going on. Uh, that being said, I don't know how much I'll be able to share, but I'll certainly try, because I feel like a lot of it will be spoiler-heavy for future books. But the other thing that I may do today, if I'm feeling up to it, is I had said that I wasn't going to work on my eminence manuscript at all during this time, but the editor that I work with reached out and it wants to know when she's going to get it and it's, it's not ready for her yet. So I feel like I probably need to uh, work on that since I, you know, engaged. I'll see you later. Bye. So clearly it's later in the day. I am home. I kind of had a, was better than yesterday, but still not great day at work. Um, again, nothing with the kids. It's all stuff that I can't get into, but decompressed a little bit my favorite thing to do right now to make myself laugh is to watch the try guys so um did some of that i gotta go run a couple errands and i hope that i'll have some time for writing in a bit all right errands are done and dom and i are heading back to my house i wish so badly that i could tell you some of the crazy stuff that's happening in my personal and professional life right now but i'm home i am making dinner i still haven't really done anything for preptober yet but it's not bedtime yet, so I'm hoping maybe I'll get to do it soon. All right, it's like 7.30 and I am done with my Preptober stuff for the day. I will be honest, I feel like I didn't get to do as much as I wanted and I did not get to my editing at all. I mean, I guess that's not surprising, but just things have been rough, kind of like I predicted they would be. So yeah, what I ended up doing for my scenes with my therapist, I actually liked what I did with Raya today better than I did for Cole. Raya kind of will be meeting with a therapist regularly anyway, based on how she's, you know, found under mysterious circumstances and doesn't remember who she is. But in the scene that I wrote, she is having memories or visions about a character that I haven't talked about yet. He's kind of our our villain, our foil to Cole. His name is Artur. And we'll probably talk about him more in a later video, but kind of how he made her feel. And she's kind of afraid to share everything because her memories are confusing and would make her sound even more crazy than they already probably think she is. Cole's was kind of like a question and answer, kind of like an interview almost. And it kind of was just putting onto paper kind of like the headcanons that I have for him that he is an orphan and what life was like as an orphan. He is named Cole because he was the third baby, baby C that year. And the mother of his orphanage called the Authorian House liked the name Cole. And then he also discussed a little bit about how he met Raya and that I'm going to keep to myself for now because it will be in the second book. Tomorrow should be, well, I said this this morning, I said it should be an easier day, but I have some meetings and things for school. But the nice thing about Preptober is it wants you to make like mood boards and things on Pinterest. And I've already been doing that for this. So I'll probably show you a little bit of that and maybe I'll add some more. But I think for now I'm going to stop here. It's getting late and my son needs a bath and I'm getting really tired. So that's it for me. Bye.